And so we, we titled this The Unbreakable Human Spirit. So tell us how that fits into this picture. Well, the humans are funny and, and we're predictable and they're, we're predictably irrational at times. And, mm-hmm. and we can, we can humorously look at that and say, yeah, you're, you're kind of uh, special, just like the rest of us. And there's something about your lived experience or your, what you're trying to accomplish in life that once you, you kind of have a better map of reality and you see that, um, Humans, no, I've I've had the good fortune to coach people in every decade of life from you know before ten up into the nineties, and one thing I can tell you is that every human wants to feel like life is moving forward. We want to feel like we're progressing, like we're getting somewhere. Like we have, if we just look back at recent weeks, we can have some evidence of progress, and that longing never leaves us. It is always part of being human. And even in the most depressed funks, people just, there's this like glimmer of like, I want it to get better. And that's that's essentially what we're talking about. That is the part of the human spirit that isn't quenchable. And it it flies in the face of the so-called great reset, where they say, we're, we're going to take all of your stuff and you're going to like it. Essentially, you'll own nothing and you'll be happy. No, we're not. There, there's, a, there's a kernel of the longing to own something and pride of ownership of, of wanting to say, I made this and I want to sell it. I want to see if people like it or we're, we're just creative by nature. And that can't be rooted out of the human spirit. But when it's allowed to flourish or when it feels like it has an, a believable outlet, and often that's a frame of reference of somebody kind of like us, which is another reason we need community so much. But when we feel like we have an outlet, there's this drive that comes in us and we want to make things and humans that... <laughs> We've survived every rough patch of history, and we are still here, and there are more of us than ever. And that's a testament to a human nature that longs for growth, that longs for purpose, that longs for the ability to um, go to work at something and believe we have a chance to influence the outcome. And when that just gets a little bit of oxygen, when that gets a path forward, it's easier to go to work on the thing today because, oh, I know why I'm doing this again. And we're not stuck in a in a past that pulls us back too much. We just need some people around us to believe in us enough to be sometimes pull us up when we don't have the strength to pull ourselves up. But that cannot be rooted out of the human condition. And the more that we can fan the flames of that or recognize that, you know what, if I'm honest with myself, I really do want this to get better, even in the worst of situations. Sure enough, we, we find the underpinnings of the motivation we need and We don't always have to act from desperation. Um, There's a will to try. There's even a defiance to say, you will not break me and I will find a way to get through this. And who of us couldn't use a little more of that sometimes? Gritty is sometimes the best way to um, move life forward. And and we become scrappy when we think there's a chance that we could um, influence the outcome and, and defy the ones who want to take away our autonomy. So there's, 